children welcome back to maths made easy let's continue with more problems based on your imaginary method here is our 10th question if the interest on rupees 200 be rupees 25 in certain time what will be the interest on rupees 750 for the same time here let's write the first given data here children if the interest on 200 rupees so 200 i'm considering it as principal right we already learned the simple interest problem if you miss it you can just check it out in my playlist i have solved all the problems or uh, in different models right so 200 is the principal by rupees 25 that means he is getting an interest of 25 so interest on 200 rupees is 25 and similarly what interest does he get if he gives the money of 750 now we have to find out one rupee interest on one rupee for one rupee see for 200 rupees he is getting 25 rupees for one rupee surely he will get less less means what division so you are going to divide 25 divided by 100 sorry 200 25 divided by 200 so here i'm not going to divide this because if you divide it you will get it in points which makes it difficult so interest on 250 rupees see interest on one rupee will be this much interest on 750 will be more surely more more means what multiplication so to this one rupee i am going to multiply with 750 now just do the cancellation and you will get 93 rupees 75 paise so what interest does he get on rupees 750 he will get 93.75 that is 93 rupees 75 paise now you same problem you can solve it even in the another method that is inverse variation just write the heading as principal this 200 will be the principal and 750 will be the principal right if you have missed that uh, simple interest topic check it out in the playlist i have done many problems on that topic 200 for 200 rupees you will get 25 rupees interest for 750 rupees how much you will get so it is considered as x see here it is a increasing format is like this so put a downward arrow here for 750 surely you will get more interest than this 25 right that means here also it will be more than this 25 so you will get a downward arrow see here both arrows are in the same direction so inverse both of them 750 by 200 is equal to x by 25 now just do the cross multiplication and since we need to find the x value get this 200 to the other side and it will become 750 into 225 divided by 200 do the cancellation and you will get 93.75 per 75 rupees that is 93 rupees 75 paise so what interest does he get on rupees 750 is 93 rupees 75 paise I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and hit the bell button. Even share this video with your friends and check the description box for more problems on unitary method. Thanks for watching.